guys, so it is my birthday today. I'm really excited. I've gotten such sweet texts and messages from friends and on Facebook and and I just had um, the dinner that I wanted barbecue chicken and macaroni and cheese. It was so good, so delicious. I'm about ready to open a card or one of my presents. And then we've been grabbing ice cream later and have church at five. And so hopefully I'll get all dressed up and do my makeup for the first time in I don't know how long, like way long. So I'll be back on my birthday. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. Who's it from? You guys. Oh. That is like one I think this might be the favorite card I've ever gotten. It is so cool. Stand tall and proud of where you are on life's journey. Look at that picture. Oh, how cool this is. Celebrate the many ways you've grown wiser, deeper, stronger in spirit. Oh, I don't know about the stronger part. <laughs> know that your life has special meaning and that the purpose of your birthday is to honor the unique person you have become. Happy birthday, daughter. Love you always. He couldn't even sign it. Well, give me a pen. I'll do it now. <laughs> Good. Mom and Dad in Mom's writing. Do you want to see it, Dad? <laughs> it's so cute. I love it. Oh, do you want to bows? That's right. Oh my gosh. Mom tapes the bows onto everything so they can, she can reuse them. <laughs> Wrapping paper, birthday wrapping paper. Seems like this is going to be jewelry. Ooh, Christmassy. How fun! Little snowflake. Yeah. Little angels. Hypoallergenic. Mm -hmm. So cute, thank you. Yeah. I think I might wear these tonight. Because yeah. they'll go with the necklace. Yeah, I'm excited because I can play with these tonight. It's a coloring book. Oh, Mom, do you know how much I love this? Mm -hmm. Because I would do doodles like this when I worked, mm -hmm. and the kids would fill them in for their art activity. And you can, you know, just rip the book apart, you know, and you can just have the individual pictures. Oh, so fun! <laughs> Each day is an opportunity for a fresh start. And another one. Oh, I love these, Mom! I can give these to people! Mm -hmm. And send them to them. They have like little quotes on each one. I love things like this, Mom. <laughs> Look for beauty, listen with love, live with intention. <gasps> oh my gosh, I love it! <laughs> this giant thing hopefully has color and stuff in it. Well, it's my inner child. I'll work. Oh no, my gosh! <laughs> Look at all of those sharpies. They were for now that I can be trusted with sharpies. <laughs> I get twenty-eight of them. <laughs> Hi guys, so I'm so excited. I just showed you kind of what I got, but it was like really dark, so I just want to show you again. Um, because I'm really excited. See, this is how easy it is to please me. <laughs> I got two coloring books. Diana, thank you so much because my parents, I told my parents, Diana um, does a lot of beautiful, um, like these colored uh, pictures. And um, she pasted them on Facebook. She's on my Facebook. So I um, look at them and I was like, that looks so fun because when I got this, it was just, it was all white. 
and then on the back just this was red and then it was all white and black so I colored it all in so when I saw what Diane had put on Facebook I was like oh, I was I would so love that and I used to do these doodle things that really looked like that and um, when I worked and the um, I would do these doodle things over this whole page and then I would give them to the kids that I worked with and they would color in whatever, however they wanted with crayons or um, color markers. So I really liked it and I asked Diana about all about it and so my parents went out. These weren't the ones that she suggested but these are just perfect anyways. They're still in the same category but I absolutely love these. These ones that are the inspirational quotes, I am on Pinterest like all day every day finding little quotes like this and sending them to people and like putting them on Facebook. If you're part of my um, Facebook page on Painful Hilarity, I post a lot of these little quotes and like these pretty pictures. So I'm really excited to have these because I can send them to people and give them to people and put them up in my room and um, I just love them so they like turn out like this once you color them in and then these ones are just you know they are like this and you color them in so this is kind of like an example page and if you do a lot of um, like inner child work these are so great for that because when I was little that's when my mom was laughing is because when I was little I used to draw with markers on everything so I actually wasn't allowed to have markers or anything that pretty much even sometimes crayons I wasn't even allowed to have so I really like it it's a lot of like inner child work and that's when my mom was like this is making up for all the time you lost with markers so getting this was like ah, I've never gotten markers like this so I'm um, so excited and I love just sitting and drawing it really is good for like taking your mind off pain or for me taking my mind off fatigue and just focusing on something and um, you really forget you kind of lose yourself in it and um, takes your mind off pain and stuff so I'm really excited I'll see you guys later Ella come here come here Sit. Good girl. You look so beautiful. Yes. Look how pretty you look. Are you ready for my birthday and Christmas? Hi guys. So I am getting ready. It's so early, but I haven't worn makeup in ages. So I'm kind of thinking it's going to take me a long time. But so I'm not going to record the whole thing because it would be so unbelievably boring. All I did was exfoliate my face because I haven't exfoliated or washed it since before we came here because my whole face was like blown up obviously. Um, I wasn't really feeling the whole taking care of my face thing. Um, but anyways, I just exfoliated with a Clinique 7 day scrub and then I used the Mary Kay face primer using my beauty blender with my true match mini which is my favorite l'oreal very busy around here um one of my friends sent me a message saying she was a horrible friend because um my the package that she sent me wasn't going to be here christmas eve or christmas but it just got here so I hope she didn't spend extra to get it here because I actually really enjoy receiving gifts after my birthday. Um, it's very, I, you know, it's pretty normal because of the crazy shipping around, you know, Christmas. So um, I really actually enjoy getting them afterwards. So I was like, you're not a bad friend. And when I went to the post office, the sh we, there were two people ahead of us and the lady came out and said that the truck was leaving so all of my packages are going to be late maybe I don't know hers she said we're, was going to be late but I got here on my birthday I got she said I wasn't going to be here till like Friday or something and I, I love this beauty blender it's like the best thing ever I don't know why I don't use it every single time it just feels so nice I just like sometimes I just keep doing it and I'm just like 
and I like look at my face and I'm like, oh, my makeup's done, been done for like 15 minutes. I'm just sitting here patting it. Oh, also from Sephora, I got my um, Vie de Rouge uh, birthday thing, which I'm not actually impressed with. Like, I feel like last year when I got the birthday gift when I wasn't Rouge, that it was like a lot better. Like, I got one full size sample or something like that. But I wanted to show it to you guys. It is um, Makeup Forever um, Mascara, which is kind of cool because I've never tried it before. Maybe I'll do like a versus type thing. This is the Makeup Forever a lipstick. It's a uh, very much a what's it called? Kylie? No, wait. Kylie Jenner. What's the other one's name? Or maybe it's Kylie. Kylie Kendall. Kendall or Kylie Jenner type color um, and then just a little black liner called aqua eyes so I'm guessing it's waterproof yeah it's waterproof so that's kind of nice I have the Urban Decay um, waterproof one though and I love it so um, maybe I'll do a versus with that one eye and one eye I don't know um, but that's it it's just these three tiny little things so I was like cool I mean, it's free, so I'm not complaining, but I'm going to make up so slowly. That's why I don't do, like, get ready with me videos and stuff. I'd really love to because I love chatting while I'm doing my makeup, but I am so slow. Like, I just sit here and I forget what I'm doing sometimes and play with Bella and I look at my hair and I look at, like, different things. And it just is a long process, so I'm like, you guys would die it would be like an eight hour long that's why i'm starting now it would be like eight hour long video so i will come back with something or other i'm done with my makeup i'm just trying to figure out what to do with this mane of hair it's a bit out of control but i was so excited last night because when I came here, I actually forgot to pack all of my flat iron and curling iron and curling wand and everything. So I took a shower last night and I was like, crap, because I didn't even bring a blow dryer. I was like, um, what am I going to do with my hair? Because um, I knew we'd be going to church, so I didn't be out in public. And um, so I did the no heat curling thing that I do with just a headband. Which I'm going to do an updated version of that because the last time I did, the first time I did it, the only time I did it, it I didn't know how to edit so it was like two separate videos and it was kind of confusing. So I want to combine it into one and do it for you guys. But um, yeah, it turned out really pretty but I just did a little braid and I have a little clip and I don't know what to do with my hair. Like, should I wear it? No, I'm not going to wear it down. Just because it looks really cute down. We'll find out. Okay, so I decided to wear it down, and all I did was put this amazing um, Mark Anthony Dream Waves Beach Spray in that I got at Sephora or Ulta. I think I got it at Ulta actually. Um, and then I put Rusk Weightless Hairspray in it because I don't actually like to um, feel anything in my hair. I don't like it to be like crunchy or anything because I like it to kind of be under control so that stuff works amazingly I've been using it for years and years and years and years and years um, but it's so funny I got the present from Monica and it's and Bella is like we're such one person that um, Monica addressed it to Emily and Bella Nolan <laughs> yep I guess my best friend knows me too well and my dog um, I think I'm probably going to open my sister-in-law's present now because she is so freaking excited that she cannot contain herself. So I'm going to do that and I am going to record it. Oh, it's for Bella! It's a fleece hoodie! And that was her name on it! Oh, that is cute. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! Put it on. Put it on. Is it too big? It's too no, small. it looks just perfect. Nice. Yeah, no. it looks perfect. Oh, it's gonna be so snuggly. Yeah, it's perfect. 
see her what? We want to see her name on it. Josh didn't see it. Oh, it's perfect. Look, Josh. <laughs> oh, kisses. Oh. <laughs> Belle, you look sharp. Belle, it's perfect. You look so pretty, Belle. Oh, you look box. beautiful. Little Bella. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Oh. Are those ones for me? <gasps> oh my gosh, that's a onesie. It has detachable feet. No. Oh my gosh, Belle, you have to get that. <laughs> what are these? Maybe that's the feet. No, it's bath confetti. Oh. That's cute. I have to get into it. <laughs> it's like it's like getting into heaven. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a wearable cloud. <laughs> Boy, that is cute. It has her name on it. <laughs> And you can stick your thumbs through it. Ah! And look. Yeah, and so those unzip at the ankle. If you yeah. Hold <laughs> bells because she's got the same outfit. Oh my gosh. This is like a Christmas story moment for yeah. Bella and I. <laughs> Wait, you're so still comfy. Soon. Look at bells. They're just going to snuggle up now. We won't be able to we get can out of the snuggle house. all the time. <laughs> oh my gosh, thank you guys so much. Awesome. I love them. <laughs> you magic pajamas, Gally. <laughs> How did you ever think of that? I was just looking up pajamas and I knew that Emmy wanted like onesies. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's my first I was one. Just, like, Googling and then, yeah, pajama grams. I'm going to put my notes right here in case I need them. When you start getting as old as I am, you kind of start forgetting things. But here, hey, it was so much fun dancing over there with you guys. Let's all say happy birthday to Jesus as long as we can. Ready? One, two, three. Happy birthday, Jesus! Enjoy this video but I just want something fun for you guys to watch on my birthday and I hope you guys are enjoying Christmas Eve um, Chris, uh, Christmas Eve service was so amazing and the whole time I was sick I just kept praying and praying that I was able to go to Christmas Eve service because I love my church here and I was just so happy to be there I just kept welling up with tears because it's just so cool it's also really fun to have my birthday on Christmas Eve. I don't like all the rest of the stuff, but it's really nice because you can't like get too into yourself for your birthday because you know that you're going to church and like remembering that this is about Jesus and the hope and love that he's given us and that's the greatest gift of all and um, 
every time at church I always just get that like cool feeling that like it's really cool because I could get really into myself and like really into like me, 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 me for my birthday but I was just laughing with my parents because one of our traditions is everybody opens up a present on Christmas Eve and um, I gave my mom pajamas and I asked my parents for one thing for my birthday and for um, Christmas and <laughs> they didn't get it for me. I'm like, you really had to work hard and like go out of your way not to get me it. But it was pajamas from pink and if not from pink, from somewhere like cute pajamas, you know, because I like to wear them Christmas Eve and then wake up with them in the morning because I like to open presents in my pajamas and like all the pictures. It's nice to have like a new pair of pajamas to have. This, I wore this last year. This was like a pink t-shirt and I had, I don't remember the pants that they got me, but um, it was just like, really? Really parents? Really? One thing I asked for. I'm just curious what they did get me now because I know I mentioned the coloring books a while back, but everything else I can't imagine. Anyways, I hope you guys are having such an awesome Christmas Eve. Cooking and baking and getting together with family. I hope you guys have safe travels. But I'm praying for all of you guys and I hope you have a wonderful Christmas and obviously I'll do a vlog tomorrow but I don't know how many of you guys will be able to watch it so I'm going to say Merry Christmas now. And I love you guys so much for your encouragement and support and all your birthday wishes. And they just mean a lot to me. You guys just mean a lot to me. You guys have been the best present probably this whole year. So, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy it and I hope I can edit it enough. Um, I don't know how long I'll last, but yeah. I um, hope you had a pain-free, stress-free day full of so much joy. And I hope you guys have a Merry Christmas tomorrow. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Merry Christmas. Bye.